To top off the evening, the formal dance. The PMC hops are gala affairs to which friends, alumni, and parents are invited as guests of the college. Such social functions form an important part of the overall educational pattern. These affairs and many other social activities of the college permit the students to develop poise and well-balanced personalities. PMC formal dances are well known for the colorful gowns, the uniforms, and the decorations. These dances are truly student affairs. The cadet decorating committees work until the wee hours of the morning before a dance, putting the last minute touches to the decorations begun days before. The ring ceremony is part of the junior class hop. As the junior classman comes through the ring, the girl places the PMC class ring on the cadet's finger. These are memorable events. A lot of work in the preparation, but so much fun. When the dance is over and the couples have had their midnight snacks, it's good night until the next affair. Or for those girls who are staying in town, good night until Sunday parade. The cadets on Sunday morning must attend divine worship. They leave the campus in the body, splitting into various church squads. Some to the Episcopal Church, others are found in the houses of worship of their choice, the Roman Catholic Church, the Methodist Church, the Synagogue, the Presbyterian Church, and others. But the religious life at the Pennsylvania Military College is not restricted to Sunday morning church attendance. Frequently, the cadets and chaplains get together for informal discussions. There are also the church-sponsored college organizations such as the Canterbury Club, the Wesley Club, the Newman Club, and the Hillo Club. The BMC fraternity sponsor community affairs of a worthy nature. There are parties at Christmas for the underprivileged children of the city and also entertainments for the older people who are confined. When the weekend is over, the cadets settle down to study for Monday's classes. Some cadets are quietly and busily at work in their quarters, while other cadets are preparing their assignments in the library where the necessary reference books are readily available. These cadets have been previously oriented in the techniques of good study habits and in the use of the library. They know where to find and how to use the card catalog, the microfilm reader, the micro card reader, and the stacks. But library orientation is only the beginning of the counseling program. Each cadet meets with his advisor to discuss the outcomes of his freshman testing program. Throughout the semester, the cadet is counseled in regard to his academic progress. He is invited to have informal consultations with his professors on either personal or academic matters. Students with specific problems, such as reading difficulties, are given specialized instruction. Here are students in the reading class. 
working to increase their reading speed and comprehension. But now for a change of pace. Let's review another important phase in the development of a cadet, that played by intercollegiate and intramural sports. There is always excitement and enthusiasm when the Corps of Cadets gets ready for a trip off campus. Tonight, the PMC cadets meet the midshipmen of Kings Point in a gridiron contest at the Atlantic City Convention Hall, a little Army-Navy game. An unusual contest at night, indoors. For the spectators, all the comforts of a fine theater. For the players, none of the discomforts of weather and winds. season, Alumni Homecoming Day brings crowds to see the big game on campus. This is another exciting day. As we quickly pass from one sport to another, it is easy to see that Pennsylvania Military College is interested in a sound body as well as a sound mind. Basically, the athletic program is intended to provide entertainment for the collective student body and to provide for the individual student participating in the program. The athletic activities are organized so as to permit every student to interest himself in some sport. PMC meets colleges of comparable size, operating under a policy similar to PMC's. The college is a member of the National Collegiate Athletic Association, the Eastern Collegiate Athletic Conference, and the Middle Atlantic States Collegiate Athletic Conference. PMC subscribes to and maintains a strict adherence to the codes set up by these organizations.